After another night of rocks being thrown at cars on Interstate 35, Austin police announced they are trying new things to put an end to it. Last night, two different reports came in just five minutes apart around 10.30 p.m. at IH 35 and 7th Street. Add that to two more the night before, and it is four in the last two days. KXAN's Chris Sadegi live at APD headquarters with a closer look at the new plan. Chris? Robert, you want to talk about brazen. We're here at APD and these two calls that came in last night came in from right there, right across the street, 7th and I-35. Frustration is mounting to find the person or persons responsible. And once again, APD is trying something different. I forgot, man, because I usually go to the top and I was in a hurry in the morning. I went to the bottom. And that decision on Saturday morning led to John Zavala becoming a victim. Oh, yeah, I saw it. Yeah, it was coming from the top. It just caught my bumper. Boom. He thinks someone threw the rock from the upper deck. And like many, he's got an idea of how to stop them. They need to put a camera on the upper deck. because Man, that's where it's coming from. This is the number one priority of the Austin Police Department. But police again wanted to announce they are trying hard and trying something new. The investigation now belongs to the Organized Crime Division, a unit Chief Art Acevedo says has more resources and also a fresh set of eyes. By moment the Organized Crime, what that speaks to is that how seriously we're taking it. The new unit will start with these flyers that will be passed around town, including 2,500 of them at this weekend's ROT rally. And as for those cameras John wanted, the chief did have this to say. I'm not going to talk about what technology we're going to leverage but we're going to leverage every technology available to us. New strategies they hope catch the person they're looking for and fast. We want to catch this person before they kill somebody because somebody's going to die. Now we still can't say right now if this is one person or more than one person, but if you'll remember last week an arrest was made. Coming up at 6 o'clock, we'll talk more about what that arrest led to, if anything, and what effect it may have on the investigation. For now, we're live at APD headquarters. Chris Sadegi, KXAN News. The APD Organized Crime Division has several units looking into different kinds of crime. Human trafficking, vice, and online child exploitation are under one investigative unit. The division also looks into illegal firearms, and it has units focusing on anti-gang measures and safe streets in Austin. Narcotics investigations also fall under their umbrella. Last month, an investigation by organized crime division detectives led to the arrest of two men accused of dealing the powerful painkiller fentanyl. The division looks into financial crimes as well. Earlier this year, organized crime detectives arrested two people accused of selling counterfeit products as brand name goods.